Hi there everyone, how are you all doing? I'm doing fantastic. Today I'll be discussing a fragrance from the house of Cartier. You can see from the title, I'll be discussing Cartier Decla Declaration Dune Soir. So this is Cartier Declaration Dune Soir. I have the sample with me, official sample. This is Eau de Toilette Concentration. Let me tell you the full bottle of Cartier Declaration I found in Bangladesh costed around 8,000 taka, which is $67 or so for the tester unit. So 8,000 taka for the tester unit for Cartier Declaration. This is the bottle, see, Dunsoir Declaration. Now let me talk about the smell. This is the official sample bottle. Let me discuss the smell with you. First, let me read out the notes. So, the Declaration Dune Soir contains black pepper, cardamom, and caraway right at the top. Then, the myth contains nutmeg and rose, and the base contains sandalwood. So, these are the notes. Now, what do I detect when I spray this fragrance? I have the dried on on my other hand. Let me tell you, this is a rose based fragrance. So, if you like the rose, this fragrance is for you. Don't worry. This is a very masculine style of rose. Even women can wear this fragrance, no problem. So if you're a man wondering about whether this is going to smell too feminine, I'm gonna say no. This is a very nicely done unisex fragrance, I have to say, but men can easily wear this fragrance. Don't so our cardiac declaration. So like I told you, this is a masculine style rose. So from the smell, what I'm getting, is this beautiful aromatic tone in the opening this one opens up aromatic there is no straight up freshness in this fragrance this is more aromatic to my nose i'm getting this beautiful nutmeg style of spiciness in this fragrance so spicy aromatic opening not to mention the rose pops up from the get-go and from the starting i'm detecting this rose so with the rose there is this beautiful nutmeg style of spiciness there's aromatic vibe from the cardamom. So in the mid phase, this one becomes mild spicy. So I'm not getting any sweetness from this, but this is more like aromatic tone, at least from what I'm getting. Aromatic, spicy, rose-based, woody fragrance. In the dry down, you're gonna get this beautiful woodiness from the sandalwood. The sandalwood gives this fragrance the spicy woodiness. This is not a creamy sandalwood. This is more like spicy sandalwood, at least from what I'm getting. So to summarize the smell, this one opens up aromatic, spicy. In the mid phase, you're going to get this beautiful rose. The rose is from the start, but you're also going to get this rose in the mid phase, even in the dry down. This is a rose based fragrance. So expect the rose. So overall, in the mid phase, I'm getting this beautiful rose. And then when this one dries down, this one showcases this spicy sandalwood. Woodiness is there. So overall, a beautiful fragrance, a beautiful blend, a beautiful rose blend. I don't like rose fragrances, but this one is a very good fragrance that I like. I also like Rosha's Mustache, the EDP. That one is also a very good fragrance. I also like Tuxedo by YSL. That one is also a very good rose based fragrance and this one i really like this one Dunsoir by cartier this is declaration Dunsoir. so i talked about the smell now performance wise let me tell you this is a banger of a projector this one projects so nicely the longevity on my skin i got five hours of longevity on my skin on my clothing six seven hours yes but the initial projection dear oh dear the projection is really nice for the first for the first two hours one and a half hour to two hours this one projects really nicely this is airy this is projecting so people will notice you even when i applied this i was constantly getting the wafts of this fragrance lovely projector this one projects really nicely creates a nice scent rain a nice scent bubble around you so performance wise really nice so occasion wise you can use this fragrance whenever you want formally casually no problem this can be a wonderful date night fragrance for you this has this beautiful rose 
inviting rose, inviting spiciness, inviting sandalwood spiciness. So lovely woodiness as well. So yeah, you can use this in your date nights as well, casually, formally. But I'm going to say when you're dressed up, this is going to shine really well. When you're going out for a date, when you're going to meet a special person, this is going to shine really well. So wherever you want, you can apply this fragrance. Wonderful fragrance. Cartier Declaration, Dun Soir. So I have talked about the smell, the longevity, the pricing, the occasion. This is, like I told you, I talked about the occasion. The weather scenario, this can be a all year round fragrance. At least to me, this one is an all year round fragrance. Summer, winter, any season I can apply this, no problem. So overall, a beautiful fragrance from Cartier. Now, to give you the summary, this is a wonderful fragrance. If you like rose, rose based fragrances, this can be a wonderful fragrance for you. So good performer, at least from what I got, this performed on my skin and my clothing really nicely. A good fragrance from Cartier, this is Declaration Dun Soir. So there you go. I've talked about each and every aspect of this fragrance. So if you guys like my work, do subscribe to my channel. I also forgot to tell you about my group. I have a group on Facebook, Fragrance Fanatics of Bangladesh. You can join my group. You can talk, discuss fragrances, your scent of the day. Anything related to fragrances you can discuss. So I'll be dropping the link as well in the description section. So Fragrance Fanatics of Bangladesh, that's my group. So subscribe to my channel if you like my work. I'll see you guys next time with another fragrance review. Take care. Peace.